We are scoring some hits against it. Medium damage, well that's fine. And we are sending some more aircraft up to this position, so hopefully they're going to find something over there. And a destroyer up here, or an unidentified ship. We don't know exactly. That Corvid is dead in the water now. And Corvids don't ha cannot have torpedoes, so that's good. And there's another unidentified ship up over there. Oh my, this is this is starting to look a little bit funny. Okay, you are not going to be AI controlled anymore. I want you to identify what's going on over there. And our aircraft are attacking someone over here. Um, no. We're not going to risk a light cruiser for that. Not if I don't know whether there are going to be any enemy interceptions. This might be a transport. That's nice. No hits from any of these bombs. Oh, but a torpedo hit. That's nice. Ooh, and a lot of hits on the battle cruiser. Corvette. Well, Corvette, I don't care about that much. So you are now over here. You know what? I think we're going to do a follow-up strike with our carrier division 11. So let's have a look at who is ready and who could be striking. So let's take the torpedo bombers from the Lubang. And from the Ranger, we're going to take some dive bombers. Yeah, and I would like you to go over here, and let's uh, launch the strike. Going to continue to put some pressure on them. This up here, we should start to attack, I think. Unfortunately, you are returning, even though we are seeing this transport uh, ship over there. So, you know what, we do need to have a look at this guy. Uh, you've got a couple of torpedo bombers. That's a lot of torpedo bombers, though. There's also a lot of dive bombers or anything other of that sort. Do we have a very small thing or something? Okay, 13 dive bombers, you know what? It's a little bit too much. But nevertheless, uh, let's set the location for you to here. And the target is that transport ship, so that should be fine. And uh, you can launch. Try to send that transport ship down. Right, and we are coming up towards the east over here. So that's lovely to see. More aircraft streaming out of our carriers. So far we haven't seen really the enemy doing anything uh, with the aircraft. Well, that's not quite true. We have seen some of their things. We should see a strike in going in this direction soon. These guys are coming back actually. And we might actually see enemy battle uh, ship or any presence sooner rather than later. Why is no one going this way? I thought I'd launch that strike. It's peculiar. What are you guys doing? You're going this way. Okay, so you might have gone out first. There was probably not enough deck space to, lo to launch the other guys. But they should also strike soon. Oh, what's over here? We are taking another battleship. Now over here. And we did not score any hits. But we are striking with some torpedoes. So we are definitely doing some damage over there. And I would expect them to be much slower. Whoa, many more torpedo sightings. And you guys here are doing something to that transport ship, I believe. Was it 17 or... Yeah, no, maybe it's you. Yeah, it's probably you. There is an unidentified ship coming our way. It might be that destroyer. 13, okay, this must be the transport ship. Yeah, it's going a lot of hits on this guy. Lots of hits on this guy. Lots of hits on some Corvette. I mean, it's nice to get their destroyers because we realized they don't have that many destroyers. The Grosny class. Interesting name. Grosny hit with a 16-inch gun hit. 
Come on, that must have done enormous amounts of damage. I don't believe that you are capable of running this far. This fast. Yeah, we are scoring now hits with our secondary battery. That should wreck them because these are these are quick firing guns. Um, and they should start to find the range soon. And do some heavy damage. And hopefully sink them while we are passing them. Yeah, that should work out. Yeah, there are a lot of further sightings of stuff down here. I'm not too sure. Whether we will be finding these ships. Specifically, I'm looking for some crippled battleships. So what have we got down here? Slow moving ships, unidentified, as of now. They seem to be crippled. It's a Corvette. And this here? What is this? A light cruiser? Really? Why do I believe this? Yet. Oh, and we've got a battleship! The Admiral Lutterev class. Heavy damage. Uh, slow down in the water. Uh, most of its guns are disabled. The heavy guns at least. It does have two more two more turrets. Um, and of course the secondary batteries. But it's very slow and, and not doing that well. So you know what? We're definitely going to ask for a strike over here with our carrier division uh, 8. With torpedo bombers. I think this is a very good target for torpedo bombers. Your target is going to be um, the... Admiral down here. Uh, let's launch that strike immediately. Uh, of course our battle cruisers here are going to try to make uh, some short work out of this guy. Uh, but we all know how, how battles against ships can last for a very very long time. So yeah. Yeah we are hitting them hard though so that's nice to see. And uh, this is actually a destroyer and I want to keep my way away from them a little bit so um, let's circle around over here because I don't want to get torpedoed. And we're still going to be able to use all of our main guns on the Admiral Latsev. Uh, simply because we're causing some heavy damage there. And it has sunk. Very lovely. No explosion, just sunk. Just just sunk like that. So that's lovely. Uh, that means we can come around. Also means our strike here is <laughs> was maybe a little bit premature with our torpedo bombers, but... I don't mind. Um, why are you not scoring hits on these guys a little bit more aggressively? Enemy aircraft are approaching Trippy. Where the hell is Trippy? I don't know where, where or what that is. But our battle division is up here. It's over here. It's attacking the Lubong and the Biscay. So that's... That's pretty bad, and these are dive bombers. They're coming up from down here, which is extremely interesting. So I think we should start to try to find things over here. So, lots of things happening. Some normal gunfire, but also we are engaging in air-to-air -air combat. So our combat air patrol um, are engaging and shooting down a couple of, well, we've shot down three, four, maybe five, and damaged their dive bombers. That's of course very good, but is it going to be enough? They still have 15, and our air, our aircraft carriers are tinderboxes. We are very, very liable to burn. 11 dive bombers left. We are very, very liable to burn, and um, should they ever ever um, start some attack on us um, and and score a hit because our aircrafts are refueling they are rearming so they are very very vulnerable especially to dive bombing attacks as happened at midway right can't see them now so maybe nope they are there 11 left Lots of heavy AA fire, so that's good to see. Okay, you guys here can go max speed towards here, over here. I'm not sure. Have we got? Have we gotten any target off carriers? No, we've not. 
It's unfortunate. Some destroyer is being hit. This is this guy. Ooh. Hawk bombers from Starbanger are bombing an enemy carrier. Interesting. And scoring a hit. Good. Good to see. I appreciate that. So enemy aircrafts were coming in from the south, so I'm wondering whether... No. Yeah, we can pick up survivors from battleship. Battleship is sufficiently large uh, to warrant that. Wait a minute, who's firing? I mean, these guys must be sinking anyway. How about you guys over here? You're still sort of floating around over there. It's a little bit unfortunate because these guys can clearly spot us, so... Um, enemy aircraft are approaching Division 9. Stop. Division 9 is where? Probably over here. Don't see enemy enemies. No, there they are. 17 dive bombers. Coming from the south... E south west, so probably over here. Lots of attacks. Lots of aircraft being damaged. No hits though. And the very least so far. Lots of air combat. It really pays to have so so high um, an air patrol proportion. 16 torpedo bombers, where are you going? You might be coming back from the strike on the battleship. That was a little bit... Okay, so I think we want to retire to our battleship. Uh, this is getting a little bit spooky. I don't know where they are. We haven't spotted their carriers at all. How is our search pattern looking? Okay, so I don't think it updates that unless you sort of restart the game. Uh, sorry, unless you restart the day. So it's basically the orders that you're being given for day. You know, we have to do more or less a 360 degree search over here. Even though these are so contained waters. Uh, no, I'm not going to pick up some things over there. Colorado is still streaming up here, um, somewhat isolated, so we'll have to be a little bit mindful of that. Uh, and you know, at this point I'm realizing it's a very long episode, so I'm probably going to cut that into it too. But yeah, that should be okay. So the Colorado is streaming what? At 18 knots, so we might want to dial down this to 20 knots as well. Right, are we getting more reports? And if so, where? 16 R Privateer. Is that you down here? Yeah, it is. But this is an AMC, so it's not, not that important. Yeah, some good hits, I suppose. No important new reports, as far as I can tell. Crone shot being attacked. So is that truly crone shot being attacked? Yeah. Very interesting. That's nice to see. So our aircraft are actually attacking their airfields. Lovely. Hmm. So, so far this raid has been somewhat of a success, I would say. Um, but, we are very unclear. I mean, we've seen a battleship, and we've sunk a battleship, so that that mod is clear. There's another destroyer down here. Okay, let's come down there, let's also prepare a strike. Uh, pff, why not with you guys? So, 10 aircraft over here, 10 dive bombers. Oh, you're all unready. Um, okay, let's look at the, you guys over here then. So what have we got? Uh, 13 dive bombers? I think that's very good. 
you guys, um, your target is going to be that destroyer. Thank you. Go for it. These guys should start very soon. What time is it actually? About noon. So about half a day worth of battle. No one yet. Two destroyers over here. Okay. I I can certainly send some dive bombers off to you as well. Right, let's take these um, guys over here. Can I change you to 18 dive bombers? Oh, you're considered unready. I would rather take someone who's ready. It's only these fighters and these dive bombers here. Okay, uh, that's fine. Okay, so we're going to take you, right? Yeah, let's take you and send you off to that. Right, and at this point I think I'm going to take these fighters here uh, that are currently ready and you're going to be told to stand down. So, unfuel you, or at least uh, get some of the bombs and, and arm ammunition out of the way and that should be okay. Right, let's see. Beercat are bombing enemy LT, interesting. Well, if our land bases are contributing, I don't mind at all. Air combat. Attack some 20 torpedo bombers. Hmm, interesting. 20 torpedo bombers. Where are you coming from? And we have been... Have we lost something? Yeah, we've actually lost a nightingale. Where are they? I mean, this must be combat air patrol, right? Let's see them, though. We are shooting down some of them, but where? Are they engaging us? Or is that... Are they fight? Enemy aircraft are approaching. Here we are, 14, 14 torpedo bombers. Uh, they are going for the Colorado, I believe. Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, so we really have to we really have to keep an eye on the Colorado. There's an unidentified ship down here. I think that's probably these destroyers. Okay, let's do come after that briefly. Although I think we should have some aircraft approaching their targets as well. Yeah, these th 13 dive bombers. Your job is actually to attack these guys here. And you should start to see them now. You are circling around here. They are trying to be driven, or they are trying to re disengage. That should bring them right into the pass. What about dive bombers? Where are you? Interesting. You're way over here. They're over here. You could relay that sighting. Well, at the very least, we are reducing their their destroyers, and that's also a very good um, effect. Another hit being scored there. Enemy aircraft are approaching Carrier Division 11. So over here, we've got a couple of bombers, apparently. No, dive bombers. 15 dive bombers. At the very least, we shouldn't have any aircraft being in store anymore, so that's good. We are damaging and shooting down a couple of them. Come on, you can score hits on this guy. Okay, so far so good. Okay, let's go to max speed over here. Because I want to get rid of this guy. Light damage, 35 chance. Come on, Electra, you can do it. I explicitly asked you to go for a destroyer. You may do it. So that's that's this strike. The 18, I believe, were the strike that we sent off to two, two destroyers. But yeah, whoo! This is this is starting to be a very long battle over here. Yeah, but we are losing contact there. So you know what? Let's get back towards our battle division 17, which is withdrawn basically. Okay, so max speed. You're gonna go there. Um, yeah, normal speed, and we're just going to turn around. 
This guy here was a little bit lucky, I have to admit. Another report maybe? Yeah, of some destroyers over there. Well, destroyers are worthwhile targets, but I'm not too sure. Right, so all the combat air patrol trying to remain ready over here. Trying to disengage. I think we've done enough damage. I'm not sure we can keep this up. Unless we are getting more reports. I think it's time to disengage. Right, so let's dial up with the speed here. Some of our ships are approaching enemies. Interesting. I didn't think I sent out anyone. No, it's fine. You don't have to go off to single destroyers. They were way too fast anyway. Nope. Oh, and there's heavy rainfall, so... Oh, but it's gone. But yeah, here is night, so... I believe very soon we should see the end of this scenario. Let's bring you over here. Um, on training knots, I think, should be fine. Okay, yeah, let's disengage. Ultra, that's okay. And here is night time. Scenario is over, so what have we done? We've sunk... The single battleship that they had. So yeah, it was really not worthwhile to stick around that much longer after that. Uh, also sunk five auxiliaries, two, three corvettes, two destroyers. Very good. They are short on destroyers and I, I definitely like to see that. Uh, only light damage on that one transport that we d did engage. And the only thing that we lost is light damage on one of our destroyers. Very interesting. We did lose uh, 22 aircraft, including 12 fighters actually. And the variety of, of other aircraft, uh, mostly due to, I would say, operational losses. Yeah, most of them are due to operational losses. Some to air, air combat, a little bit to AA fire. Soviets lost 73 aircraft, including 44 dive bombers, most of them to air to our fighters. Yeah, so our fighters did a very, very fine job over here, um, and that is very, very nice to see. Let's look at the ship details, especially at the uh, battle uh, ship over here. So you hit by seven bombs, six torpedoes, and a couple of heavy hits. So, ooh, and your lock entries are corrupted for some reason. That's all right. Um, other than that, you were, yeah, I mean you, you were really being hit hard. I think from the first air attacks, do you still carry torpedo mounts? That's that's a little bit hilarious. Right, and all of you guys have been sunk very sorrily, so yeah, lovely to see. Excellent, excellent result for us. 7,000, Rosala. Lovely, very good. So let's look at the Almanac. One battleship down uh, for them, the Admiral Lazarev class, uh, of which they do have a couple, so it's not the most modern one, but it certainly is a very nice win for us, so. Yeah, very happy about that, and I do look forward to continuing this war next time around. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Do leave a like and all of that if you want, and see you guys next time. Bye-bye.